Hi there, YouTube. I have headphones on listening to music because I want to listen to music because I'm tired and it is 3.06 a.m. And I thought I'd do something really shocking, really shocking and amazing and um, groundbreaking, never before seen footage of um, me knitting a, <coughs> knitting a scarf. Uh, it's simple to do. I guess this is a tutorial video. I'm talking over the singer. Why am I talking? Okay, um... Maybe I'll play a little guitar. This was meant to be a guitar video. Um... I don't have anything on my face. Why am I not wearing a costume? Okay, um... So, yeah, 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 you're right. Uh-huh, uh-huh, uh-huh. Wait, is, can you copyright humming? Mm-hmm. <laughs> is, this is, I don't know, I think there's some kind of power in doing this. You know, you could say it's meditative or spiritual or like, you know, like relieving anxiety and stuff like that. But I think there's like actual like um, magical power in um, knitting. Not, ma not, not, not like magic that doesn't exist. Like, like David Copperfield does magic. And um, you can say, but no, he does real magic, but real magic doesn't exist. But you can't argue that it's magic, but right? Does David Copperfield? There's Ted Penn and Teller. Um, they admit their magic is fake, and they say they're atheists. Um, um, and Penn had a show on the podcast uh, website, um, and he said he said he had never done any drugs. Which, you know, I, I don't know, maybe he spoke about, like, does he drink coffee? Like, has he had a soda? He looks like he's probably had a soda. Uh, no offense, I, look, I'm drinking soda right now. We're kid, kid folk. Okay, so he says he's an atheist, and he says he's never done drugs, and, um, and he says, there's two times in your life when you should do drugs. I'm... I'm, okay, I'm, I'm not stealing his, maybe I shouldn't say it. Okay, just listen to Penn, Penn and Teller podcast. I don't want him being angry at me because I tell his bit about his desire to not do drugs. But the, like, um, I looked at the dictionary and if you look at the beginning of books, the beginning of books has, um, has, um, um, uh, uh, they, they have the copyright notice and if you buy or if you go to a library or a bookstore and you look at the Oxford English Dictionary they have that exact same copyright notice and what the notice says is any part of this book in part or whole if it is reproduced without permission written permission by the whatever whoever the publisher is which, like, the publisher looked like it was, like, maybe, like, like a lord of England, or, like, maybe a church of England, like, it was some freaky old stone mansion kind of thing. So, any part, any part of the dictionary is copyrighted. That means any English word that, that is widely accepted as, like, if I were to say T-H-E, that's copyrighted. The, the letter, the, the word the is copyrighted. And if you write a book and you write the word the in the book, you can be sued. Technically, I, I really don't know law culture. I mean, it, it would probably be thrown out of court, but that's what the copyright says. So, um, does that, is that not a case 
to invalidate all copyright and start a revolution um, with D Mark David Chapman. But no, the thing is, like, a lot of people say when they're young, they say the Beatles sang about revolution. Um, I said that, I think. But their song Revolution 9 or whatever, um, so you want a revolution? The, the, their song is like, they're being super sarcastic. And it's like 1968, so wow, they're so progressive. They're sarcastic in 1968. Anyways, um, so uh, they, they say, they're, they're like, oh, you want a revolution? Well, yeah, you know, everyone wants a revolution. Like, just go do the things that people do. Do, like, do, do, just the world's all right. And, and Bill Hicks talks about this too. Bill Hicks tells you to take magic mushrooms, uh, psilocybin mushrooms, which I don't, I'm not saying you should, don't do that. Don't. That's what he says, not me. And he's dead. And <laughs> not from the mushrooms. Anyways, uh, so, um, so, <sighs> what am I saying? Okay, revolution. Bill Hicks. Oh yeah, D Bill Hicks. And okay, is this copyright? Is it copyright to tell about a Bill Hicks joke? Basically, Bill Hicks says like, I'm I'm paraphrasing. Can you paraphrase? I don't even know like the university rules for like, you're you're supposed to have source material and you're supposed to base your knowledge on source material but you're not supposed to plagiarize. And so you have to reward, but you can't just say it like, move the words around and it's the same sentence. It has to be reworded enough. And I don't really know any of this. Um, I, don't, I, I don't know. I don't know. So I'm afraid to even say the word the. And, um, if, if, if you've, so we're, we're just gonna, you don't want to watch me net. I know you don't want to watch me net. Um, uh, but, uh, I will stop this music and play some, some guitar. And I'm really quite, um, adapt, 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 adaptable. Can you even say the name of a movie's title? Like the, the title of a movie. Can you even title, like, if I said adaptation with Nicolas Cage, was it Nicolas Cage? Like, is it copyrighted to mention that, that there's a movie? And, you know, yes, I know it's a pretentious fake art film, like Hollywood art film, which is an awesome movie, but no, it's not an awesome movie, but yes, it's not, oh no, 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 no. Okay, okay, I just really messed myself up there. So, um, to the powers that be, if you're a big Hollywood bigwig, I absolutely love adaptation. I've watched it 15 times. I've actually watched it a few times, actually, actually, actually. Um, uh, but, like, <coughs> if you're... But if you're like part of like the punky like you were there, but the day and that's not good, but this is good. That's not good, but this is good. Then I say adaptation is bad. If if I I was one of those, I, I'm I'm of you. I I I am of the Hollywood elite and I am of the cynical underclass. I am of the people, and I think, um, uh, um, that brings us back to the topic of re revolution. Why is revolution on my mind so much? Um, we could talk about my personal life, <laughs> but no, uh, but no, no, I'm just, I'm, I'm gonna be... I kind of am in a weird place right now.
not a G. I think the G is supposed to be set. I'm, like that's a that's a okay. I understand why they call that B, and you know there's many reasons, but G I think is supposed to be sexy. That's not sexy, but my tuner my tuner thinks it's sexy. And then B is unsexy. And who am I to even like make claims about what's sexy and not? Because I am an unsexy person. I will be an unsexy person my whole life. You can flatter me all you want. You can say I look good. You can say that I have superior talents and abilities and that um, people all, all, all over the world, all types of people, there's mass movements, the streets are being flooded, I'm so sexy, and I will not believe you. Even if you show me vo video fo footage, even if they tear down brick by brick my house, come, come into my house, lift me above their head, and carry me, like carry me from Canada, Toronto, Canada, into Brazil, and you know, I'm, I'm not having sex with any of them, I have a girlfriend. But even if these millions of people carry me to Brazil, I would not believe I was sexy. Um, I think that's fair. Oh, my sheet music is actually not here right now. Uh, Where did I put my sheet music? Oh, where did I put my sheet music? There are kinds of ways in which people say And I say to them I want to be a the yellow tambourine. That's probably copyrighted. So this is Tennessee Waltz. Mm -hmm. We're gonna play a little Tennessee Waltz. I haven't played it on this guitar yet. I played it on the classical.
and actually, me, 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 me. <laughs> oh, the Tennessee Wolves had a profound defense on how, on how I delivered my speech. between the bars. your entertainment. <laughs> I'm tired. If you want me to uh, entertain me more, please allow me to sleep properly. <laughs>